Hi there. So I am in the mountain town of Szczawnica in southern Poland, walking down some stairs. And I'm here to go to the Dunajec River Gorge, which I'm going to do by bicycle. So I'm going to go and hire a bicycle now. Here we go, here are the Rovere, Roveruf, that I'm hoping to Vipozicalic, Vipozicic. This is my Rover. And uh, let's go. Well, just me, you can just stay at home if you like. Here it is, here's the river Dunayet. I'm going to be going up that way. So it looks like there's a bike path at least for some of the way, which is pretty cool. And uh, Stravnica Pristan, that's, um, I think that's where the rafts come in. A load of things you can't do here. I think that's no telling people off. Oh no, cutting the path, look at that, it's like Formula One. No slapping plants. No luring fish to the death. Oh, rock falls are allowed though, they're fine. So this is the border between Poland and Slovakia. It's getting a bit colder now, temperatures dropped and I'm cycling of course, but this is pretty nice. So this is where it starts getting a bit gorgy apparently. Danger of all kinds of death. This is going to be one of those videos, isn't it, on YouTube? This is the last video he shot before he died in a low speed accident. So one of the things this gorge is known for is that you can go on uh, rafting tours from the other end, which is a hydroelectric power station, and then you can raft all the way down. Now I'd read that they don't run at this time of year, that they stop at the end of October, um, principally because this would make it the... I'm waving at us. This would make it the hypothermia tour, but um, there are people on rafts today. So we come out of the gorge and then suddenly it's really pastoral, like Hobbiton. So yeah, further up that way is the hydroelectric power station. I'm on the Slovakian side here. That is the Polish side over there. Uh, the river is actually, as you can tell, is the border. Um, but then it sort of wends its way back into Poland higher up and, um, and at the other end as well. In fact, it actually, it's a tributary of the Vistula, I think. Okay, so I think I've come to an end here. The path does go on, I can carry on upriver all the way to uh, the hydroelectric dam, but I'm not really that bothered. I think I've had enough excitement for one day. I may have to go and have a lie down. Um, so we're done here, but I'm gonna go and see a local chapel. I believe that is the uh, Red Monastery, Czerwone Klasztor, Czerwene Klasztor. Here it is, Red Monastery, Czerwene Klasztor. has a museum apparently that I can't be bothered going in. This is the little cafe at the monastery, how cool. Okay, so that's me done here, and I'm going to head back to Szczawnica now by bike. Uh, I think it's really well worth doing, and I'll have to come back sometime and uh, go down on the raft.